Hey everybody, this is Jane from Justin TV, and I know it's been a long time since a lot of you have seen me, and this is probably very weird that the camera's moving right now, because usually it's standing stationary. Um, but I am doing a different type of video. I don't know if you've seen it, but there is a new app out. It's called Maximem, and I'm just going to be doing kind of a little review about it. So let me go down to my iPhone and I'm probably gonna have to adjust a couple settings so you can see my iPhone and everything mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. yeah there it goes so this is my iPhone got the 4s it's fancy schmancy um the app that I'm gonna be talking about is called Maximum and I have like about a million apps. It's in here. And it is this one, if you can even see it. Um, focus probably won't work. It's, it actually says the name of the app right there. Oh, here she is. Maximum. Cool, eh? So this is the app. Face value, very quick to open. Um, you can kind of see it looks like a kid's game like just by looking at it um, so just from here just the opening screen you can go ahead and start the game which is pretty awesome uh, right there so if you knew how to play you could just start playing if you don't know how to play then you just felt like a total doofus pressing start game so I'm gonna go ahead and walk you through everything that goes on on this page so see first button is settings gives you all these cool things to look at um, you can kinda tell just by the title of each thing what it's gonna be talking about theme under look and feel theme is gonna be what your icons are so all those shapes you saw at the beginning is shapes so let's say we want to change it to sports press done and now they're balls so there's basketball soccer ball um, you can do random stuff like transportation and now there's really cool cars so whatever you like you can go ahead and check your um, theme and it'll tell you what kind of icons you can choose I'm gonna do fruit because fruits pretty cool so next one down is background and background is your backdrop so I don't even remember what it is now green yeah green let's say I want to do orange because I love orange actually my favorite color is brown there's no brown oh yeah go away there's no brown so let's say teal that'll work sound noise is the note that's gonna be played or sound that's going to be played every time there is something that needs to be done so right now I think it's on raindrop if we do beep press start game ooh it beeps so there's beep car horn I found that car horn and dog bark are a little obnoxious so whatever you like it's just it doesn't seem like I should be playing a game with a dog barking or a car horn. Especially if I'm like in the subway, which there are zero subways unless you count the restaurant in my area of Texas. <coughs> um, anyway, going on, there's different game types. And normal is just going to keep the icons the way they are. Rotate, they rotate clockwise. Um, random means some of them will rotate and other ones might stay the same or they just change the whole time so normal is usually what I keep it on um, it just gets harder whether it's random because the icons that are um, going in the sequence will stay the same but they'll be rotating so and there's also skill level which easier uh, easier easy is going to be slow medium is fast and hard is very fast and I've actually saw that uh, cool. Um, fast isn't 
Uh, okay, yeah, that's really obnoxious. I'm changing that to beep. So <laughs> I think I've got huge fingers, and that's why it's doing this. So I'm going back to beat. And fast, if you play the game, it's not really that fast. I mean, you can kind of see it is a little bit faster. Yeah. Um, then there's other things in the miscellaneous category. Help, if you have no idea how to play the game, it tells you right there. Um, buy if you want to buy the full app. And I press this button earlier and I say cancel and then it tells me this other thing. Error, there's a problem in transaction. Probably because I said no. Um, restore transaction, no idea. Um, and there's support and support tells you about the app if it'll ever load. It takes you to the I iPhone page, I think, or the iPad or app page. Gosh, I can't even talk. Tells you about the app, tells you about the maker, and I guess you can leave cool comments and stuff. And I guess you could share it on Facebook, too. That's neat. Neat! Okay. Um, leaderboard. It gives you the, um, different game types, whether you did normal, rotate, or random, and gives you the leaderboards of each of them. As you can tell that I play this game way so much. Um, I don't think it does the leaderboard for every single time the game is played on every device. I think it only does it for this device, but I think it clears it every time you try and play it. So, I don't know. It's weird. Um, so you can also share it with your Facebook friends if you'd like. Or you just finish, like you're done. Buy full version, you can also press this button and buy the 99 cent app full version from the homepage. So, if you don't know how to play, game is like Simon. Now, I don't know if you know what Simon is, but Simon is a game where y there's four colors and each of the four colors will light up and you have to press the same sequence in the four colors. So, there's circle, it's like this little plastic game that a handheld game and there's four colors that are pressable and each of the four colors like one of them will light up like red will light up so when it's your turn you press red then the computer will play and it'll say red blue so you would press red blue so it's like follow the leader but it just um, adds one more item to the sequence so I'm gonna turn it down a little bit I don't know if it is to you but it's a little obnoxious to me how loud it is start game so orange. Now orange blueberry. Uh, there it goes. Orange blueberry apple. Orange blueberry apple. Etc. And I'll add one more thing and it'll keep going. Um, so what you're trying to do is press the right items, gosh, in the sequence. And if you press the right items, it'll raise your rank. Which is a little confusing because you would think rank is your rank in the leaderboard, but it's actually the amount of points you have. So depending on how many right items you get in the sequence, your rank goes up. Which, that's kind of cool. Um, and also, if you're tired of the sounds, you can press the sound button. It'll turn your sounds off to where you're just playing the game with the light up fruits or dogs or cars or whatever you want. That way you can play in the subway without dogs barking and cool stuff happening. So that is the game. That was kind of a long video and I can't figure out how to turn my gain back up. There we go. Um, that is Maxi Mem. You can find it in the Apple iTunes App Store. Um, it's free or if you would like to buy the full app a full version app. It's probably ad free or something. Um, not quite sure. So I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you enjoy the game. Let me know what you think in your comments and I'll see y'all later.